Okay, today I'm going to try and do this uh, Christmas sledding winter image using the Cricut design space and we'll try and cut that out with a knife blade on balsa wood. We tape down our, we use our strong grip mat, we tape down our balsa wood. I am not using masking tape like other people are talking about. I'm finding that it rips the mat really bad so I'm just using regular old tape as long as my my mat has still got some tack on it. I tell it to go ahead with the balsa wood, 332. The other option is 116. And then I press, done. It reminds me to move the star wheels to the right, load the knife blade and the mat. Our time is 8.36. And so we're waiting at 8.36. It's a 12% cut right now. It doesn't, it's not giving me a time frame on the cut for some reason. Okay, I just got an update. My, my uh, resolution's not great here on the camera with the sun coming in. So it is now 28 minutes remaining, two out of seven passes, and it is 8.40. I just wanna give you a feel for if you're making a cut like this, sorry for the bad resolution. It's about a 30 minute cut. Thanks. Okay, so here's the finished product. It turned out really nice. This will be great at winter time and Christmas. I almost sold out every time I made these for the fair and for Amazon. I'm going to show you a little something my son from Farmhouse Furniture Texas said. Flip it over if it's something that's not words. Now look at that. Those track marks, see those track marks, those depression grooves, whatever la language you want to use, look at that. It makes it not look so nice, but if you flip that puppy over, you got a nice smooth surface. And if you're doing words, just use the mirror image font. I'm sorry, not font, the mirror image uh, click on on Design Space. Thanks for watching. We'll do, we'll do some words next time and do the mirror.